A bit of homework for Highlanders assistant coach Mark Hammer to head of Friday night's match against the Rebels in Melbourne. Despite wins over the Chiefs and the Reds in the first two weeks of Super Rugby, he's not content with the way his side's been playing. We're way off where we know we can be, so attitude's exactly where we want it to be, but just around our implementation and some of our skill sets, there's still lots to work on, as you'd expect you know, two weeks in. The Reds exposed a few holes in the Highlanders' defensive line last Friday night, tackling at times looking like it was optional. We got our structure, we, we had our position, we, we knew where we were going but we didn't hit the fire button. So, um, and there's obviously some individuals will be disappointed with, with just one-on-one -on -one missed tackles. The Rebels are coming off a bye after starting with an impressive win against the Brumbies in Canberra, who in turn thrashed the Chiefs last week. There's a feeling this season the Australian teams aren't the pushovers they may have been in recent years. Yeah, I think um, Aussie has, Australia has showed that um, every um, World Cup year they're strong and that's 2019 World Cup year and they seem to begin stronger. Adding to the challenge is the likelihood co-captain Ben Smith will be rested as per the All Blacks welfare agreement with Super Rugby franchises. None of the nation's top players are supposed to play more than 180 minutes over the first three rounds. Smith's already played all 160 minutes so far, paving the way for fullback understudy Josh Mackay. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, obviously, being able to be behind Ben Smith, learn off him. Um, pretty much for me, I've just got to soak as much uh, soak as much up from him while he's in his last year at the Highlanders, um, so I can look to put my best foot forward um, leading on to next season. Midfielder Rob Thompson may miss the game with an injured ankle, while Liam Squire has an ongoing hip issue. But Dixon and Lock Tom Franklin are available to boost the forward pack after their off seasons in Japan. And Dunedin, the South today.